So I did this recently in one of my resin runs, and it's uh, the pronotum of one of my favorite species. Needs a little bit more resin over the top to deal with those pits there, but I was pretty happy with how it came out. And so these are the leftovers after adults die of this species, which are Halloween hissers. As you can see, that female walking this direction is a lighter morph. And then this is another female that's darker, and then this little gentleman is hiding right here. Has those taller horns on his pronotum. And these are just some of the gentlest of the hitch hissing roaches for sure. They do have a little bit of an attitude, but once they've been handled, they don't hiss any longer. So to keep them hissing, you don't you should try not to handle them quite as often. But Elipterhina javanica is the scientific name. And this is a great insect. It's a good composter. It'll eat through a lot of waste. Great for children to handle. It doesn't have any defensive mechanisms. It won't bite and it won't spike you very badly. They do have those smaller spikes on their legs there. But this species, they're pretty reduced and they don't use them very often. And they work great as chicken food if you want to raise something that the chickens can nibble on after it does composting for you. This species is awesome for that. Great in enclosures as a just a display animal. It's beautiful. So yeah, there's the Halloween hissing roach. Smaller, less intimidating species of hissing cockroach. And definitely my favorite. Very pretty species, very gentle species, very colorful species. And they're cleaning his antenna over there. Very clean species. And keep them around 80 or 90 degrees on one side of the tank to get them to breed. Keep another side of the tank a little moist with misting. I try to avoid any of the gel foods. I just feed them apples and zucchini and turnips and carrots and banana, whatever's extra that I don't want. Keeps my diet healthy, to be honest. <laughs> But there you go. If you're looking for a smaller pet roach species or a good composting species or a good way to give your chickens some extra snacks, look no further than the Halloween hissing cockroach from Madagascar. Oh, goodness. Oh, whoop, there's a hiss. You can see them contract their abdomen when they hiss. There we go. So most animals, or most insects, when they make noise, there we go, when they make noise, they're usually rubbing a body part together. Hissers are one of the few species that are actually expelling air in a forceful way to make their hiss instead of rubbing something together to make a scratching sound. Ooh. Yeah, not too fast, not too much of an attitude. There you go. Thanks so much. If you have any questions, let me know. And as always, don't forget to please the algorithm, like, and subscribe. And thanks for checking out some of the ambassadors.